Hey guys, and welcome back to Sonic Adventure 2 Battle. It's another hunting level with Rouge, but this time we are not hunting for Master Emerald Shards. You'll see. You will understand after this cutscene, not cutscene. It's kind of a cutscene. This is Rouge. I have located Eggman's base, and we'll proceed to enter it now. <sighs> I hate to say it. I guess I'm going to have to find that key first. Why do you say, I hate to say it? It's just a weird way to phrase it, I feel. I mean, I get what you're saying, but still, it's kind of a silly way to word it. <laughs> and you said that key. There's three keyholes, which usually signifies three keys. Come on, Bruce. Unless you have one key that opens three of the same locks in the same location. Oh, that's not how I like to start this level. But anyway, uh, it's not the worst thing in the world. Losing rings doesn't hurt you that much in hunting levels. It's much more important in racing levels. Anyway, in this video, you're gonna see me get one of the first upgrade items in the game. It is, drumroll, Rouge's Pick Nails. Now we can dag, dag, yes, we can dag into walls, no. Dig into walls and the ground, but not all spots on the wall and all the spots on the ground. Because some parts are covered up by steel or metal, things like that, that we can't dig into. Good thing we have that though, because some of these keys are buried in the walls and ground, and my god! How many more times am I gonna do that this level? Nope, you're not getting me. Nope, not today. <laughs> That's enough of that, thank you very much. At least now I have my magnetic shield, and oh no, come on! I just got this! Uh, I'm sure there was shadow somewhere, but I was too impatient. I tried to run away. No, but there was definitely shadow in that hallway. And yes, Obochow, I found the stupid things already. Stop nagging. I could have sworn there was a stack of rings there. I should say, I have a box full of rings around here. You know, I make the point of explaining how unimportant rings are in a hunting level. And then I spend 15 seconds looking for one item box. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, okay. Yeah, when you hit the shadow, he loses sight of you. Yeah, basically with that guy, when he starts beeping and the light in the room turns red, that's when you know he's about to attack you with those laser things you saw him wreck me with a couple times. Green light means he's about to enter the room or he's already in the room, but he doesn't see you. And ah, there's the key. There we go. But if you go to the shadow, he can't get you. He's not going to see you. Unless you touch him in the shadow. I found that that doesn't help and that he just attacks you right off the bat. I think separating a distance between the two of you also causes him to lose sight, but I'm not sure about that one. I might be wrong. And we're already down to one key. Now, I meant to explain something in the first video, but I don't think I ever did. Well, I touched upon it a little bit, but you know. So there are three types of levels in this game, except for one weird one, which we'll get to later. There's racing levels with Sonic and Shadow. There's hunting levels with Rouge and Knuckles, and oh, come on. This is going to be the Ugly Duckling video the LP. And then there's shooting levels with Tails and Eggman. So that's the basic structure of the game, and I'm being driven crazy by this. Is it here? Go to there. How about left? Up here. Yep, got it, finally. Alright, I hope you enjoy. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And there's gonna be a cutscene at the end of this video. But this is the last you'll be hearing from me, so I'll see you next time. Rank A. Called it. How is that? Perfect? Like me? It's a space transporter. The destination has been set to... Ark? Wasn't that space colony shut down over 50 years ago? What's he doing up there anyway? Doesn't matter. It's my mission to find out what he's up to.